Hello, my name is Dr. Bola Aladigbami, and I am a surgeon at the Belascaron White Center for Advanced Surgery. I specialize in minimally invasive surgery, specifically abdominal wall reconstruction. Today, I wanted to describe inguinal hernias and how this might be treated. An inguinal hernia is a form of hernia more common in men, but also occurs in women. This form of hernia occurs due to weakness or a defect in the groin muscles. You may notice a bulge. Patient symptoms could range from discomfort, pressure, pain, to nausea, vomiting, with changes in bowel movements, and also changes in the bulge, such as an inability to reduce the bulge, increase in the size of the bulge, or changes in the color. The simple answer is no, especially if you're asymptomatic or minimally symptomatic. This simply means you may have a reducible bulge that is causing you minimal discomfort with no other symptoms. Patients that are asymptomatic can safely be observed with the caveat being a small percentage of patients will become symptomatic every year. For the symptomatic patients or patients that elect to have surgical intervention, we offer two same-day surgery approaches. One option is an open repair which requires an incision over the inguinal hernia with a repair of the muscles and reinforcement with mesh. The other type of surgery is a laparoscopic or robotic approach which requires three small abdominal incisions, a posterior reduction of the hernia, and reinforcement of the muscles with mesh. The type of surgery selected is influenced by multiple factors. My team will have a detailed discussion with you in order to select the best approach for inguinal hernia intervention. Thank you.